This module will walk you through the process and purpose of filling out and maintaining your individual transition plan, which will be referred to from this point as ITP. Please print the core ITP before beginning the module. You will fill out the ITP with your personal information. You are required to show a copy of your pre-filled ITP upon arriving to the GPS seminar. The ITP is a living document that will allow you to document your plan for transitioning out of the Marine Corps into the civilian sector. The key to a successful transition is planning, which requires a carefully thought out ITP. The ITP coincides with the transition GPS, goals, plans, success, outcome-based curriculum, and provides a means to discover and explore your skills and interests, which may lead to potential post-transition career path. The ITP helps you identify critical activities associated with your transition and your transition counselor will assist you through the process of organizing your transition into manageable skills. Your Pathway Supplemental ITP will allow you to jot down all the information that is specific to your needs to be successful in your chosen field. Please fill out the top of page one with your full name anticipated EAS, rank, unit, data schedule GPS seminar. List your three top military occupational codes. The ITP help you to establish a timeline for completing all required activities prior to separation. It is a living document and can be modified at any time. It is a roadmap for obtaining your employment, education, technical training, and entrepreneurial objectives, and can help you make a successful transition to civilian life. Page two of the ITP identifies the requirements that each pathway will meet upon your completion of the transition GPS seminar. Once you have identified which career path you will choose for the week of the transition GPS seminar, you will be required to meet the minimum standards of that pathway. This section of the ITP should be discussed with all family members who will be affected by the move. Pages three through five helps you to analyze your family's transitional needs in areas such as housing, locality, medical expenses, and possible resources. Please take some time to go over pages three through five and identify your family transitional needs. Just like a deployment, it is necessary to understand the impact of your family during your time of transition. Not only will you be changing careers, but your family will also be changing careers and lifestyle. There are several websites that will help you research some possible options for housing and VA benefits. Please take time to visit the identified websites to familiarize yourself with these services as the websites will be addressed again during the transition GPS seminar. This section of the ITP will require some research on your part. In order to be successful in your planning, you need to identify the tools that you already have in your toolbox. You will be asked to pull out your VMET, verification of military experience and training, and your SMART, Sailor Marine American Council on Education registry transcript to help identify experience that will assist you in college credits, job skills, certification, and licensure. Please take time to review the websites on the next two pages, seven and eight, as they will be revisited by the Transition GPS seminar. All seminar attendees participate in two days of Department of Labor-led curriculum designed to prepare you for the civilian workforce to include career search, resources, interviewing techniques, resume writing skills, and advice on dressing for success in the civilian employment sector. You will have the opportunity to choose one of four pathways, depending on your post-transition plan, employment, education, career technical, and entrepreneur pathway. The employment pathway will continue with even more in-depth assistance in resume writing, federal resumes, and interviewing skills to include mock interviews and interview debriefs. On Friday, you will have the opportunity to participate in an employer's panel. 
real recruiters from the private and government sectors discussing their organizations and how they may accept resumes for your consideration of employment. The education pathway is the preferred choice for those currently enrolled or attending a four-year institution or interested in pursuing a bachelor's or graduate level degree. The deliverables include completing your FAFSA and enrolling for GI Bill eligibility. This pathway will also provide a financial brief to assist students during their college years, an explanation of accreditation, and an overview of the research websites like College Navigator, ONET, and BLS to assist students in determining the best path to achieving their future career. The vocational technical pathway is primarily for individuals with hands-on learning styles looking to pursue a career using a licensure, certification, or apprenticeship program. Participants may wish to use their experience combined with state, federal, or local credentials to reach the next stage in their career. This pathway provides an introduction to research websites, College Navigator, ONET, and BLS, and a financial overview of paying for training using the GI Bill, in addition to other low-cost methods. Apprenticeship programs and GI Bill funding is covered in the VOTEC pathway. The Entrepreneur Pathway provides an opportunity to discuss the world of small business ownership. Participants who successfully complete this pathway are eligible to register for a no-cost, eight-week online business seminar sponsored by the Small Business Administration and taught by Sarah Cruz University, Whitman School of Business. You will have the opportunity to discover your perfect business as well as learn about business plans, basic business considerations, marketing, business financing, legal business structures, basic financial concepts, and the different ways you can go into business. You will also get a wealth of resources and tips for aspiring entrepreneurs. Now that you have completed this portion of your pre-work, you will need to download and print a copy of your certificate for completion. Please bring it to the GPS class with you.